All right, let's take a look. Okay, so, okay, the first things first, let's quickly take a look at his, just his builds. Okay, so, so background story for like the stream chat. Background story is that I was watching Med climb RTA. Now I can't, I don't have any place to really say it because I only made it to master. Um, but he was trying to climb to champ and there was a lot of like issues. And one of the issues we found out was that he didn't even mole his heroes, but now he did. So it's not as bad as it could be. So like, for example, Ru what the heck? Oh, what? Your Ruel is like fully mole. Okay. It's so like, it's fully molded now. Like, I don't think his Ruel was molded when he was climbing. So that was like, that was like one of the <laughs> panic. That was, yeah, she wasn't right. Yeah, she wasn't molded at all. And he kept on struggling. We're just like, what the heck? But then it's just like all his heroes that he drafted was, was not molded. So it was just like, it's just a lot of stuff. Um, so uh, let me let me let me think about like how I'm gonna help you here because I saw a lot of issues like I could help like on every single part or I like, given advice it might not be good help but I would have given advice. Uh, let's go with level maybe or grade. Let's go with grade. Um, and the thing is the thing is I mean you look at his sky stone right. He he's not he's not he's not free to play. He's not free to play but he definitely had issues of distributing his wealth like i don't think he exactly knew what he was doing exactly and i don't mean i don't mean to be offensive though i really don't i'm not trying to be jag and ramsey here but I, I would just say that for the i think looks like a free to play uh <laughs> Uh, anyways, let's take a look. Uh, how do I, how would I even, all right, let's see, let's go with, let's go with like the heroes that maybe that are kind of like meta and maybe you should work on first. Like, okay. Okay. Like a Roz is a pretty good one. And actually, do you have a lot of gear? Actually, let me, let me check that first. Do you have a lot of gear? That's just like not being used. Um, Let's go with level. Let's go with all. I'm just looking at the uh does everything is everything equipped? Um like you have like leftover stuff. Like that's actually pretty good. Okay, well you did 90 it, so that's good. Um Let's take a look. You got a speed boot a spare. 36 crit damage. Might be usable for a bruiser. 81 flat defense. That's actually pretty good stuff. Unity set 17 speed. Okay, that's usable. Twenty-two crit damage, sixteen crit rate, nine attack, and eight health. Very solid. So you got some good stuff. I guess you're not you haven't used them yet. Twenty-three crit rate. Crit damage, you got health and effectiveness, probably another bruiser piece. Okay, okay, so that's all the 90s you have. You don't actually have a lot of 90s. Let me count the the rows. You got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 9 and 7 pieces. Okay, that's actually not a lot. Uh, let me check your reforge. Whose whale account is this? I'm gonna collect this. By the way, don't don't I, unless it's just capped. Don't let your heart of Orbis cap. Like those are like good resources, especially if you want to go free to play. Okay, so you have a lot of reforged mats. So maybe you don't have enough good gear. Yeah. So I mean, one one of the big things, obviously, don't allow your resources, the free rechargeable resources, to over cap. Um, if you're free to play, of course, if you're a whale, like big, big, big whale, and you don't care, then I, I, I can't say, I can't convince you otherwise, but, uh, uh, wait a minute, you actually have, you actually have decent stuff. All right, so now I think our objective really is to find heroes we should build and to see if you have the pieces. I think that would probably help you the most. I remember Ruel was a pretty top pick of yours. Like you pretty much always went for her. Mm, I don't remember what else. You ended up going with more tanky stuff. 17 speed on that helmet. 
24 crit damage. Let's take a look at the build again. Too slow for a cleave. You're too slow for a cleave. <laughs> right, right, right. Oh man, oh man. I feel I feel really bad actually just outing you for that. But yes, med med's major issue originally when he was climbing was that he was trying to cleave people. But uh, what was your oxlot speed at? Like 250 or something? 269? Was this slower than this? Is this improved? Oh, it was always 269? Yeah, but then somehow he either got outsped. I think that was your main issue, actually. You just got outsped. Like, they contended and then you just lost. Yeah, too slow near champ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 269. Oh, I would, I would love to have that weapon. I want that one. That would make my speed gear per perfect or complete. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, so so you didn't end up cleaving, and you don't have any better speed gear. We could check this. We can check this really easy. So speed speed to me is like one of the easiest ones to double check if you got the like the fastest gear. What's your ox last one? That's 16 and it's 90. This is 85, dude. I think you could build a really fast oxalot, man. You should even even think about that, unless you don't want to cleave anymore. 16 is the max on the chest. So like, do this exercise. Like when you're looking for like the best gear. Like this is good. I, I don't know if you already do this, but you should. Oh, this is this isn't even 90. Although you have too many broken pieces, um, you wouldn't be able to complete a full... What do you mean? Oh, can sort. Wait, did you not know you can sort? Yes, you can sort. It's a very, 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 very important thing when you're optimizing builds. Okay, you have an immunity piece here. Okay, dude, dude, dude. You can actually build a pretty fast hero. Um... Yeah, okay, so this was the major problem I had when we were looking at his account, like, over Discord. Like, just like when he was doing RTA, we were like, hey, show us this build, show us this. But we look at it, and it's like, he has untapped potential. Um, like, he could have used it, but I think it's more of, like, he needs the sense. So you got, dude, you got 21 speed on the helmet, all right? 21 speed on the helmet. What was the Broman ring? So this one? 19 speed here, right? I mean, it's an effectiveness one. Maybe you could use this on someone else, but... Still, that's like that's a lot of untapped speed, man. Can I can I sort by speed here? Substat speed. I don't think it prioritizes it. No, doesn't prioritize it on the reforged one. I think uh, ability. I don't know what that means. I don't even know what ability means. Yeah, so so he he could have gained they, just from the helmet itself, man. Holy crap, dude, that's a huge upgrade. I would actually reforge it. I would consider doing this the uh, the Araminta one, even if it's not for her. Like twenty one speed is no joke. Um, you should definitely reforge this. One of your priorities. Yeah, I can't. Um, yeah, it doesn't really track well in the reforge view. Yeah, I would definitely do it. 21 speed, anyone in their right mind would just immediately make it faster. Okay, well, that's kind of interesting just to know that your Oxlots could have been maybe fast enough. Um, it's just giving you an idea on my, on Terra's account, the ult I'm running. His Oxlots is only 270 something speed. With an imprint, it can beat like, you know, like the, like the fast, the fast players, you know what I mean? It's like two two seventy four or something like that. So, so I mean that's that's pretty decent for an Oxlot, uh, without imprint if you can get him there. Uh, but that's if you want to do that. Let's see, Roz, we have not i ninety gear. Uh, you got some weird. Okay, you got these ones. Oh, it's actually okay for him, I guess. But I would rather have immunity. Chaos Dragon, Dragon, I need to get help get rid of some gear. Any advice what to drop? Drop anything that has low gear score. So you need to uh you need to learn learn how to calculate gear score, or rather just know when you max roll something, when you min roll something. Anything that's under a certain threshold to your like I guess to your level, 
you drop it immediately you, you don't even keep it you don't even keep it and say that hey maybe i could use it on this hero you just don't if you if you want to drop gear that is um yeah do you have much immunity immunity and speed let's see what kind of priorities you have Roz is really good so i would definitely highly suggest building him Well, Uzel, I don't think he uses any hero that he, like, I don't know. He he has like a, he has like Ruel. Like Ruel is like his first go-to. So like when I was watching him, he relied on Ruel a lot in his fights. His Ruel is actually pretty decent. Um, 18, almost 1900 defense. And uh, 17,000 HP is pretty good. Especially you with missing some flat health here. Because this is not 90. Um... This is okay. Like I wouldn't I actually wouldn't change this through well. Maybe adapt to it uh for the new season. Immunity. Immunity set for sure and lower the effect resist. You 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 eventually need to start drafting in a way that you can burst down your opponents quicker. Um instead of relying on frenzy. Ruel has fallen a lot with new frenzy. I don't think I don't think Ruel really should be falling a lot. I think it should be more of like the drafting method should be different if you still draft Ruel. It's like you gotta you gotta have more damage now. You can't just sustain and then hope that they can't sustain themselves. That's I think that's the change really, the biggest change. Med frenzy abuser. Um yeah, so I think I think everybody's yeah, it's going going away from high high effect resist, um, unless it's like Momo, because Momo's case it would be like she would really be only fighting against the control comp abusers. So like uh, 300, 300 effect resist Momo, but you still have to draft a way that you can kill off the opponent really quick. Ruel is the bait now. Kron uh not that's actually not that bad that's not that bad okay so I think I think you I don't know if you used Kron you auto lose against those control comps too not enough res on gear but it's not even yeah it's, it's the thing is about like Ruel is like even at 170 effect resist right the way you have her like she's going to be controlled right she's going to be controlled um because the effectiveness is too high on usual effect like controllers did you use crow did you use crow i think you did i think that's i think that's fine immunity set and i think he should be okay for a while Yeah, serendipitous, that's the better way to say it. Dedicated control, yeah. She, that's not enough. That's why people just go immunity and just go like 150 effect resist. Um, but I think higher speed and tanky now probably pay off more. SSB. You used her, right? You did use her. In RTA? Yeah, um, your defense is too low. Like... Even just for like a DPS one, this is too low defense. What can I what can I do to help here? I think you've already you molded her. I think she was one of the, double S whale, you big whale. Um and he has a 30 specialty drink too. Slate? Uh-huh. Sure. Sure it is. I'm just kidding. Uh, Dizzy, Dizzy, I would say she's a priority build. You should build her. Um, you should focus on her. Uh, what's your What's your hunting? Uh, too little effect resist. You may as well You may as well go with effect resist set on this. But I guess you need to farm more. Maybe Maybe that's your case right now. Yeah, Sage. <laughs> Um, DN is good enough, but right now she's hardly used. I don't know if she's gonna make a comeback. To be honest, I'm kind of hoping for DN return with like an EE or something. Uh, yeah, it's kind of like too low to reforge. Not worth it to reforge. 
This one might be okay for the speed. You get uh, you get two rolls in this. Twelve speed, twelve speed, immunity. It could be used on good on a knight. You got ninety defense as well. So this this neck, DN neck, I would say this is a high priority reforge. To me, I, I would definitely think that this is good. Um, uh, let me do let me do a check on this. Let me do a check on this. If you can build DN250, she's good. And what, like for anti-cleave? Like, it, against the, at least in season two, the, the meta pure damage picks, I don't think she's be that useful. Oh, 13 speed. Oh, you rolled it three times? Feels bad, man. Okay, yeah, so yeah, th rolled it three times, 13 speed. Defense is very very high, that flat defense, and it's main stat health. So yeah, I would I would do it. This would be usable on a lot of heroes, uh, knights. I guess so. Weavers now as well because again we don't know if the effect resist will be that useful anymore. So I would do it. I would do that one. Uh, let me let me yeah, let me keep keep going through your builds. I think this is how I like to do it actually. Maybe maybe my help here would be what you should reforge. Because I think you know how to build, um, and you're just lacking gear to get to the build that you really want. But maybe maybe you're hesitant on reforging because you think it's low stats. But this one's actually pretty good. This one's actually pretty good. Um, on average, people have about, uh, let's say, 500 to 600 defense. Um, very little heroes go to like 700 defense. Um, so 90, 90 flat right there is already like pretty high and then you're at 119 after reforging so like it's actually pretty good uh, with 13 speed and means that health it looks really bad yeah you just got to keep in mind that the flat defense you gotta do your division versus the hero you want it on and it ends up to be like it's okay um i would say this one's okay i would definitely do that one i did say that many times apologies yeah this one is 90 uh alina what? Wait, is that all the heroes? You oh wait, this is blue. Ha <laughs> ha I locked it to blue and Soul Weaver. Okay, let me uh, keep going. Where was I? Right, DN, Alina, or Alencia. Okay, you have a lot of 90 gear on this. I am curious where the stats are going. Oh, 24 crit rate. Hmm. Hmm. It's, it feels like a. You have an, an S imprint as well. Feels like a pretty low roll to Lencia, like in general. Like every, everything's a bit low. Like too little defense. Speed is too low. Crit rate's okay. Crit damage is okay, but it's all like pretty low. You have too much attack, actually. That's what I noticed. A nineteen hundred attack is pretty high on a Lencia. Almost two thousand. Yeah, you actually have a lot of attack. I think that's where it's uh, that's where the wasted stats are going. Too much attack. Yeah. Like if 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 you don't want the attack, that is. I'm assuming people want her to live longer, which defense will play a lot into that one. Uh, Lilibet is not needed here. Uh... <laughs> I saw you use green Armin in your guild the last day. You freaking try hard. Um, I, I don't have any comment on that. It's okay. <laughs> I'm here to make fun of Med. But no, I'm taking on his account help because I actually really like Med. Right? So even if I sound toxic, it's just a joke. But I actually like him. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. Like he's he's like one of those he's like one of those players that are like really humble and then when he when he thinks like when he talks like he knows something he he really doesn't so then I just kind of like feel really bad for him but I like him because he is humble I 
Uh, the Charles is actually, uh, it's actually, like, decent damage overall, but no, no real imprint, so the crit rate lacks, it's okay. <laughs> Tofu? <laughs> no, I don't know. I just something weird. Sometimes, sometimes there's like some people, you know, you just you just like instantly like, huh? I kind of like this person. It's not that I don't like anyone else. Tofu. Okay, that's not what I mean. Um, but uh, yeah, the Falcon Clover is too slow. Like way too slow. Hey, maybe you could use the um. Maybe you could use that Aramint. I know you use your Aramint a lot. Your Emma Ara. But uh, maybe you could use that helmet on her. She's too slow. Though, in my opinion, like it's tanky, but honestly, you're you're you don't have enough stats in this Falcon of Cleary. It's not overly tanky that it merits it to be slow, it doesn't have high enough effectiveness to merit it to be slow. So, this is something you could work on. Falcon of Cleary is so disgusting, and I don't think she's gonna change either. She's probably gonna get better with the frenzy as well. Chaos Dragon, he means we're second place. Feels bad. He only likes me and Med. Wow, very cocky, Nixie. His F Cleary is like the other guy's F Cleary, but minus 40 is to me. <laughs> the stream chat is so toxic. Oh, that is so funny. No, this is so funny, man. No, um, yeah, I think you might have the gear. You know what? Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's build a, like a decent Falcon of Cleary. Let's see what we can do. Like if you don't use your oxlots, maybe we can maybe we could even strip your oxlots gear, you know? Like keep that in mind, right? Like don't don't think that oh I'm 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 I might use them one day. It it doesn't really most people don't do it. I'm talking specifically RTA though. Like you may not you may not want to always just have RTA hero, heroes built. But Oh uh, your raw your raws are looking pretty bad, so uh, Actually, you know what? This is actually not that bad. It just lacks tankiness. I actually prefer... Let's see. Let's see what we can do. Uh, I see. This one has no tankiness. So, other than speed... No, that won't work. This one has tankiness. Hold on, let's see. You do use him for Guild War. Ah, I see, I see. Don't don't worry, don't worry. I'm not going to commit to it. Um, There is no free equip event. I'm not going to commit to anything here. So don't worry. I just wanted to see like what you can potentially do. 10 speed. Okay, so... Okay, so... Okay, so your chest definitely have... Like a lack of speed. Like the jump is huge. You have 116 speed gear here. And then... Okay, wait, wait. I'm not doing all sets, right? No, I'm not. Yeah, <clears throat> the gap is pretty big. Oh, uh, that's only if you're desperate for speed gear. What I like doing is like if I if I start seeing like the scap, uh, the speed is at like sixteen, and it jumps all the way to ten, on a specific set. I I craft, you know, all my mats for like that one piece until I get something that can kind of fill in the gap. So like a sixteen speed, fourteen speed, and a twelve speed and stuff like that. But obviously you want to hit twenty plus speed. Um, but there's a huge gap, which means that when you're trying to build a hero, let's say you want a speedy hero, you're just going to be like, oh, I can't build them. Um, so that's, that's my methodology. Uh, take it with a grain of salt. You don't need to apply it, but that's what I like to do. That's how I make sure like all my heroes are like usable. Um, especially when the roster keeps expanding. 12 speed. So this is a 14 speed. If you roll this twice, could be even 15 speed if you rolled it three times. Yeah, we're taking your best speed gear already, so that's not really that good. But 257 already, just two pieces of Oxlot gear, and this one, and that completes a, a, a effect set too. Let's see what kind of rings you have. Speedy rings. You got a 12 speed on Basar. Okay. <clears throat> you actually have a lot of speed gear. This one you can't reforge. Like, this would be, like, 15 speed. 14 to 15 speed. I know it's a blue. But maybe for, like, a Basar, it could work. Nah, it's too low. Nah, it's too low. Even if it's 14 speed, it feels too slow. Okay. 
Neck will look like a road triple C. Pretty good for blue. Yeah, right? To get the... Yeah, because you get speed. Yeah, and then you rolled speed again. So you rolled speed tw twice, yeah. 14 slow. Okay, whale. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see. I'm not gonna... Again, I'm not gonna commit to anything. Don't worry about it. Uh, just... Uh, just want to see that. Uh, where is it? This one? 15 speed. Wait, what? Oh, it rolled twice small. Um, 15 speed effectiveness on a speed set. I think it could be 90. Sadly, it's a blue, but honestly, it could be. It could be. That could be 90. Wow. 12 speed, 28% health on this one too. Too bad it's too much attack. Otherwise, that one would be a good knight one as well. Yeah, I think I think it's more of like... I think you don't know that you're sitting on some decently good gear. This one's also 15 speed. Uh, it's got effectiveness. No defense. This one's worth it too. <clears throat> I think right now you don't need to worry about like the best gear, but like these are actually usable gear. Um, and if you don't use them on your best heroes later on, when you get upgrades, you can you know they will still be usable on on someone a bit lower. Um, so I think actually I think you have the gear. You just need to reforge it. Yeah, and I guess and I guess you should like start looking at a hero you really want to build well. And then seeing what kind of pieces you have for that hero, like what we just kind of did for that Falcon and Cleary. Um, and then build from there. Because I, 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 f I feel that you probably have something here that can make a really good Falcon and Cleary. Let's go health and defense and then not care about the... Wow, okay. 22 health, 20 defense. But does it count if it takes away from other heroes? <clears throat> well... Uh... Obviously, you don't want to you don't want to take away from your other heroes, and you don't want to rely on that all the time, because then you're gonna get into a cycle of never having gear at all. Uh, but like temporarily, like if you need to make a hero better, I, I just feel that like you do have gear that's not like this one for for example. I think this one is ninetyable too, especially with your gear level at the moment. Hey, serendipitous, thank you for the sub. Really appreciate that. Like this one's this one's definitely 90 able. It has 65 flat, which is about 10% on average on even knights. Um which means it's a 38% defense boot, and then you got a 7% health. So we roll it, it becomes 8%. So that's pretty solid. I think it's definitely good. Yeah, you can use it on Oxlot too, yeah. You can use it on anyone that needs to be tanky. Um uh, Falcon Clue does benefit a lot from defense, but her healing is skilled on HP, which is kind of weird. She's a defense scaling DPS if you want to use it that way. And then and then as her heals based on health, it's kind of odd for me. It's always been. I think you can get something good here. Just just based on speed, health. This one's 15 speed, right? So keep that in mind. That's 15 speed. Let's take that offline for a sec. This is 10. Let's check the rings again. The Bizarre one, I'm assuming you do use Bizarre. Oh, you, you don't have other options after that, sadly. 21 crit damage on Luna. Eleven speed on this with 16. Dude. You might have some already decent gear for a good Falcon of Cleary. Let's see. 
Yeah, these ones are used, so I'm not gonna take them. Let's 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 do our job of not taking the gear from the heroes that you have said you have uh, built. Cerise, do you use her? No, I wouldn't. Nah, probably not worth it. Yeah, the flat HP. Look, look, look. I mean, you have percent HP in this. You have high speed. You have flat HP. Falcon O'Cleary, really, all she needs is high speed and tankiness. Um. And I would, I would say that it's fine. I mean, you kept it for a reason, right? I'm assuming you kept it because you didn't know who would you go on, but then who is it useful for? Like, this could be useful for, like, Tamarine and stuff, but she's PvE hero, so it's not like you will ever build her really well. Yeah, Cerise's base uh, speed is really crazy, yes. She's one of the easiest heroes to get to 300 speed outside of, like, Assassin's Sid. Um... Yeah, let's just, let's say we don't take the uh, chest. Okay, are you using your Cerise right now? Not really. Yeah, because it's not even 90 gear, right? So, say we put that on her. We go with... I really, I'm really tempted to take this from Araminta, but I know you use her, so... I just want to see, like, some kind of quicker... So that was, this is three speed. You got five speed on the boot. So that's eight. And then you got, I don't know. I don't know what this would be. Maybe 13 then, two rolls. No, it's three rolls as well. So 14 speed. So 14. So we got, uh, you got three, you got three. So six and you got 11, 11 speed on top. No, it's still not fast enough. No, it's okay then. Then, then it's okay. Guild War to play control of it. I saw your I saw your Guild War man. It's just like Araminta Burn, Araminta Abyssal Crown, Araminta Burn, Araminta Abyssal Crown. You said a cheater man. Just making those Ruels look like like garbage. 100 percent skill? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Right. No RNG involved, right? Just go reforge that ML Aura helmet. Yeah, yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Hey, hey, Med, I'm gonna do it, okay? We're gonna reforge that ML Araminta helmet. Unless you have her speed tune to go under Basar or something, I don't think it's a bad thing to do it. Um, you will do it. Uh, highly recommend it. 21. You're not gonna regret. Yeah, it's all mechanical skill, yes. Yes, it's all it's all Med controlling the, uh, the RNG. Well, no RNG, right? Pure skill. Uh, hold on, wait, let me check that ring, that flat health ring. I'm not gonna do it, I'm not gonna do it. Like, even to me, like, doing flat health is very weird, unless it's, like, insanely good speed. So, okay, so look at this, alright? So, yes, 13 speed, nah, probably wouldn't merit one, uh, reforge, I mean. But it could be used on Basar. Um, my, my thinking of Basar is that, uh, having him about, like, 60 to 100 effectiveness is good enough, unless you run him on a defense team, which I don't think yours would be, because your Basar is pretty slow, right? Um, I, I personally feel that Basar, even in RTA, just enough effectiveness is good enough, but he's mainly there for the strip, so you want to soul burn it anyway. 250-ish? I mean, I'll take a look at your Bizarre. Um, Like, my, for example, my Bizarre right now is on a main stat. I think a main stat defense or health, but the neck is the opposite. Um, so it's one, one's a main stat defense, one's a main stat health. And I did it because it has more speed, and I haven't, I haven't felt that I needed the effectiveness. That's like 65 effectiveness, which is good for PvE if I ever need him to be. Uh, let me take a look at your Bizarre. 250 is pretty good, so what kind of gear do you have on him? Is he stealing some good... Oh, he's on immunity, too. Uh... Yeah, so, like, this is paper. This is paper. Like, I would not... I would not trust this Bissar for almost any content unless you can guarantee that you can kill off the enemy right away. 19 speed crit damage... Neck. On immunity, sadly. But 19 speed is 19 speed. Sixteen speed helmet. Yeah, I know he's a level fifty only, but even if he's even if he's level sixty with even the last uh, last weekend is as, as effectiveness, I think. Um, even with that, he's not he's not even like maybe he's at like ten thousand HP. It's still too weak. Yeah, 
Yeah, I would change the ring too. Yeah, what Snitch you said. I would actually change the ring on him. I would make it... I, you could even use the flat health ring. If you're going to keep him level 50, especially. Because <laughs> you have nothing to scale off of. Um, You could definitely... You're going to soul burn anyway. 128. Meh. And you don't have anything... Yeah, look, look. You have no Mola. So you have no proc rate. So you don't need that effectiveness. Yeah, flat is not bad on mages. Listen, listen to snot you. Listen to snot you. Hold on. Um, like, look, look, look. Like, especially if you're not gonna max his level. Like, look at that. Like, 3,000, 3,300. And this isn't 90, right? You're losing one speed, but then once you 90 this, you get that back and more, right? So, I, I, I definitely keep this one. Definitely keep it. With 20% health, flat, flat health, good speed. I would definitely keep it. 68 effectiveness this is good for pve as well so if you need him for you know violin strip for some kind of like abyss although i think you need 75 now but whatever it's pretty good how many mola does he have now good point let me see i think he still has a lot he 73 <laughs> what a noob i'm just kidding i'm just kidding dude dude like okay there's so much I have to do, man. There's so much I... Okay, we have to be like... We have to look at like... Okay, what are his core heroes? Are they molded? Okay, FCC is... 23 Epic Catalyst? I know, he has so much stuff, man. Like, most of us would like kill for all this stuff. Uh, 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 this FCC... Not on immunity, not enough defense. Otherwise, speed is good, HP is good. This one is plus 15. <coughs> Why did you plus 15 her? This is, this is what I don't get, actually. Was she a bruiser in the past? You used to build her as a bruiser? Okay, okay. <clears throat> okay, but that, that makes more sense then. Otherwise, you're just triggering me with all these weird, really, really weird decision-making. Uh, Lilius... Okay, it's not even... That's actually not that bad. 23,000 HP, 1,400 defense, 223 speed. Self, uh, uh she has a, a imprint. Kron was molded, right? Uh, Crow is plus 12? Okay, to each their own. I mean, he can't, oops, sorry. I did the screen, I think the screen minimized. Plus 12 ungeared K run. No, no, he's geared. What are you talking about? He's geared. Looks way better than your scuff Lilius. It's actually, uh, it's actually surprisingly decent Lilius. It's like on like, sec like it's on 67s. That's, that's why I was kind of surprised. I was like, wait, what? I'm like, that's actually not that bad. This is a this is a good one to ninety two I think um, you got flat defense you got like really good defense and it's a main stat and you have speed in there um, <clears throat> it won't be a bad one to ninety maybe not for Lilius but it won't be a bad one to ninety though yeah like you have some weird gear on but she's actually pretty good like easy ninety right easy ninety yeah think so let's take a look. I'm actually having a pretty decent time looking at this stuff. Because it's more of like, I want to hit him on the head. But, like, yeah, that's actually pretty good, man. 31, yeah, this is solid. You do it, do it this, do this one. 31, um, it's about like a 5%, 5% flat defense on average. So it's about a 30, you know, 36, 35-36% defense, 65, and you got 7 speed. I would do it. It's okay. It's actually worth it. 9 crit rate actually might be good too. A lot of people running knights at 50% crit rate. So. We're not joking about it. Um, to me, it depends on your priorities right now. So, if you don't feel like you want to do it right now. But it's definitely one that you could. Uh, we were at Lil Lilius, right? Yeah, we were at Lilius. And uh, SSP was Mola. Right now, we're taking a look at Mola. I'm just going everywhere right now. Just because, like, you have so much stuff that I can talk about, but I can't really formulate how I want to help. Um, 
if you have spirit catalyst for three stars if they do damage i would just do it um 15 damage could be the missing link of you killing off your target when you need to but that's just a little picky thing um it won't cost you much except the catalyst i would just do it anyway dn right we took a look at her mm, you if you if you plan to use your dn more uh i definitely suggest you plus fiving this um if she if she's buffed it doubles the cr boost so we're talking about uh if you get to plus five it's 15 percent cr boost but if she's buffed it's 30 percent right that's a pretty big jump 30 percent versus 20 percent of what you have right now um and this this technically should be molded but again doesn't matter i guess the barrier is good. The end barrier is good because it's scaled on the health of the target, not her her HP or whatever. So for beefier, healthier heroes, that 15% barrier strength actually kicks in quite a bit. <clears throat> the pay the payoff is good, but that's only if you want to use DN now. Um, and since people are being like really hesitant on DN, not sure where she lies, you can save it for now. But that was like maybe last season, I guess. Your lens is max. That's good. Charles is maxed and probably not used. Landy, bru going bruiser Landy. All right, this is this would be a fun project as well. So you'll be lacking some stats because he didn't reforge these. Oh yeah, no, you don't. You don't want to. No low low gear. Salty gear, not high priority. 13 crit rate, pretty low. Oh, it's got a flat attack. Eh, not on her. Probably not. Okay. Soon TM. Plus 15 Landy where? Says Melanie. Ludwig. Justina, what else did you use during your go like uh, during your RTA climb? You honestly stuck with like the knights and then Ruel. Did you do you own a Spectani? I think you do, right? Let's take a look at that. Looking at the Tempesturin. Uh, really low damage. Oh no, Melanie, I know, man. Lanny is really good. Lanny's really good. Okay, so. It's very, very good that, uh, you know, all these top players are saying that Apocalypse Robby is really good pick. So I think Mola investment wise, I think you should anyway. I mean, I, I would still use her to be honest, but um, mine's kind of not built in the right right format anymore. Yeah, I know the, uh, the gear on her needs upgrades. This one actually might be okay to uh, reforge, this A. Robbie one. Let me, let me keep a mind on this, hold on, A. Robbie right here. I think this one could be good. I don't know if you guys think the same. I think you low rolled crit crit damage a bit, but I think it's okay. It's good, right? Yeah, it should be it should be good. Yeah, that's pretty solid, man. Twenty two defense. You got you got you got health. You got speed. You got twenty eight crit damage. Um, I think this one's priority. Definitely good. He didn't do daily summon. No. Um. <laughs> I'm not gonna ask him if I'm gonna do it, but like if he wants me to do it. But if we if he if he wants me to do it, I can do it. I can give him some dragon magic. He might get a five star ML. Is this someone random just says do it? No, I have to I have to wait for the account owner, man. You can't just do that, man. I could break uh I could break Smilegate's terms of service if I do that on someone else's account. Um Dark Corvus on immunity, Crimson Seed, I mean it's usable. It's actually pretty good defense. And you're not fully 90'd. Pull me ML5? Wait, what do you mean though? What do you mean? Mad. Well, how, 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 how do you want me to pull you the ML5? You, you say it, man. I do it, man. I give you ML5. From daily? Okay, let's do it. Okay, you want me to do it? 
I do it. Let's let's do a little quick break. Very odd ML Ken, but you know what? The stats are there. <laughs> it's got like and this is like one of those uh what do you call it? Like if you go to those like high-end restaurants, you can buy like a platter. Like a platter. Like let's give you go to like a barbecue shack or whatever. You can buy those platters where it like gives you like a, a little bit of like everything. This is like this is what that Ken reminds me of. I just had barbecue tonight, so it's got a crit set, it's got a resist set, it's got a attack set, it's got a speed set. It's amazing. <laughs> Gear set sa yeah, sampler. That's the this is the term. Okay, let's do it, man. ML5. Let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. Let's make it You can make me you can make me famous. People are gonna get me to do their summons. Right? ML5 on your free daily, right? Let's go. Ah crap. <laughs> I was trying to be Whoa! We got an ML! I got you an ML. Did you say ML5? You said ML5. Oh crap, you said ML5. You said ML5, never mind. I was gonna loophole you. Okay, hold on one sec. Let's go back. Um, ML Ken. We're at ML Ken. And uh, let's see. Okay, yeah, we're getting to the dark. So this is gonna be quite interesting. The FCC. Yeah, FCC's not really there. Yeah, you just need better gear. You, you, none of these can really help her. 11 speed, 20 health. This might actually be usable too. It has 11 effect resist. This one actually might be 90 bull. Not for her. Someone else. It might be usable. Let's take a look. FCC. I think that's 13 speed. Maybe even 14. But the it's got it's got a splash. It's a useful, a usable one on a, on a soul weaver. Just missing defense, but I think it's usable. Uh, we're let's see here. FCC. Did I miss her? Missed her. Oh, it's right here. 13 speed. 13 speed, 24 health and 14 resist. Yeah, I would say you could do it. You could do this one. Yeah, it's worth reforge, reforge I think. You have- wait, wait, you have so much immunity? But you don't hunt immunity. Or you don't hunt Azimani, do you? Mm. You do most are bad. Okay, you have a lot of weird ones that you roll to the max as well. You Um this one's actually okay. Maybe like a Tyranner Guard type PvE. That ring. Oh anyways. I was just surprised that you're uh Okay, we're at ML Ken. Let's keep going. So you definitely have some gear that you can uh, 90. You can 90. You just need. I think you need to gain the the game sense and 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 be confident in it. Sometimes sometimes people roll like 90 stuff just because it makes that hero better, even though they know that's not really good to 90. Whoa, wait. Oh, it's on attack. I see. Um. Otherwise, that's really high. I thought it was a speed one. I was like, wow. Wait, what are the stats? Um, you know, the RB is pretty solid, though. You use him to cleave. That's why attack boots. Hey, no, no worries, no worries. I, I do it, too. I do it, too. Oh, that's actually a good ring. That's actually a really good ring. Oh, sorry, a uh, neck, neck. Okay, the boot, uh, 13 speed. Hmm. See, Dom, it's, it works. I think it's lacking a bit of crit damage. Spec 10 -y. okay, let's take a look. So, not on immunity set. The damage stats are there, low on crit rate. You don't have tankiness. I would say this is the only issue. And then another issue would be like if you want immunity or not. Let's say you don't go for the immunity type, it's still too low. In terms of tankiness. 91% crit rate is very low actually. It's very low. Yeah, 90 gear for her one day maybe. Let's see if we got the gear. Mm. 
see if you got the gear so let's see if you actually have immunity speed that we can make here with 12% crit rate what do you have here you have only crit rate you have six crit damage definitely tossable so you can get rid of that armor without losing much um say cool crit damage oh oh dude oh gosh i feel your pain man 22 effect resist i feel the pain the heck 24 24 defense it's 90 the crit rate is actually too low Spectani needs a lot of crit rate. That's it is pretty hard to build here. Um, and getting enough crit rate. Do you use your Alexa? No, you don't, right? You don't really. Oh, you do. You do for Wyvern. Oh, okay, okay. Never mind then. This one, this one might be interesting. I, I'm gonna check what this looks like on a Reforge. It's wasted, I guess, effectiveness, but. I'm gonna check what it looks like on a reforge. Say so crit rate, crit damage, or mains. Uh, you don't have enough gear. Sad. So in terms of tankiness, it's already looking a lot healthier. You need uh, you need a uh, crit rate on the boots. You need crit rates on boots. For sure. Th 19 crit rate, yeah, no attack. This one might be okay. Why do you have this just sitting here? 35 attack, but then you got crit damage. Use crit rate neck? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, mine was used to be a crit rate neck one. Let's see what we got. Too low. 23. Wait, 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 wait. We might got something here. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I think we might have something here. Uh, and then now we, we funnel crit damage. Oh, shoot. Oh, this one's heck. Ri this one's really risky. This one's really risky. This is like 20, 23 crit damage, I think, at uh, at 90, even as it is. But that one's really risky. So you really can't actually go away from it. Um, you don't have much crit damage, high crit damage uh, can enhance if it poten I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think, Iggy? Would you enhance this? I don't know, man. This is a bit. This is a bit risky. If it goes to effectiveness, you're kind of screwed. If it goes low health or defense, you kind of screwed too. Like, I don't know if I would roll it. Not worth, right? Yeah, not worth. No, I I wouldn't roll it. I always want to pull your K-Ron. Let's just pull the K-Ron gear for now. I know you probably use K-Ron a lot, but in my opinion, I think Spec is much more usable than K-Ron. Um, and she's always been, like, very oppressive in RTA. So it's like, it's no... Like, if you have a good Spec it's not a waste. Okay, that means the chest can't be that immunity one. It needs to be 25 crit damage, eight crit rate, and we got health, four speed. So right now we're looking closer to your original build, but with 100% crit rate, this is, this is all 90. This one would be, we need, uh, we need more crit damage and attack. Won't Spectani be more likely to be banned than Kron though? Well, I mean, if Kron is your like only threat, then she would be, uh, he would be banned too, right? Like it, it all depends, right? Some sometimes people ban Spectani, sometimes people don't. I was surprised how many people don't ban Spectani, but sometimes you really just can't, you can't get around it. So that's why the like trap trapping your enemies is the best way in terms of the draft. Yeah, don't forget immunity if possible. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't think he has it. I don't think he has the gear. Like this... Wait, 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 wait. How much do you use your ML Ken? 
It's got the platter special, but it's actually got a good helmet. It's like really good helmet, actually. Very good DPS helmet. Uh, probably better for a thief, though, but still. Like, uh, do you actually use them? You wouldn't use them in RTA, right? So, like, do you use them for Guild War? Not that much, only sometimes for Guild War offense. Guild War offense? Honestly, you could, like, supplement him with anything, and he sort of works for Guild War offense. You don't need this kind of gear. This is actually good gear, Med. That one. That one's actually really good. Um... Like, right now, like, if we can complete the immunity somehow, right now that looks pretty solid to me. It's already more tanky. It's just not hitting the tanky threshold yet, but... You got a bit of flat defense to gain here. You got a bit more damage to come out of this one, too, if you reforge it. This one... This one you could reforge. It's usable on, uh, if it's not her, on some kind of cleave DPS. <clears throat> so, like, you could reforge that one, too. You just need immunity. Sadly, you don't have a weapon. You got crit damage, you got health, you got attack. Wait, wait, wait. And then five more here. So 97% crit rate. If you get this one, it's 99% crit rate. <laughs> it's actually not that bad. Use 88 chest? No, but 88 chest... Okay, well... Well, yeah, yeah maybe I could look for crit damage somewhere else. 88 chest already has the crit rate, right? So I'm just thinking... Like, would you want that? Yeah, let's use the 88. Let's see. Wait, where is it? Watch right here. It's got good tankiness. It is a good one. So, okay, just we just need crit damage then. Crit damage and maybe even attack and health. And that's it, pretty much it. Let's say go crit damage as priority. Uh, speed one. 20 crit damage, 13 effectiveness. Ideally something with... What the heck? Wait, do you use your Luna? Crit damage is on the lower side. I still prefer about 60s. Although there's a 20 for... Yeah... I don't know. Yeah, I think for the tankiness, this, this one's fine. But this one has 12% crit rate. Maybe you could get some more speed out of it. If we're gonna go for that. 12% is too much crit rate. Whoa, wait, what? You only have... Where are all your 88s? You can't tell me you only played Hell Raid twice? No way. Is that what you're telling me? You bought the daggers? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. What the fr... Okay, 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 okay. So, so... Uh, let, let's let's push it back a bit. All right. So from so from now on, um, I would go for armors. Especially right now, you're really way over on the swords. Like that's way too much. Uh, you go armors. Go armors for a while. Um, the, the the only reason why I say this is this is that immunity is very hard to roll in general. Immunity is just very hard to roll. It has enough stuff. In the especially in the chest stats that this could be used on a lot of heroes it could be used on like again spectani it could be used on like kind of dps bruisers it could be even used on healers and knights and stuff the overall payoff for this chest is really good just because in wyvern the there's less rng for speed gear yeah i would do that and also the fact is that when you uh, 90 the weapon it gains you more stats 10 more flat attack than an 88 so the chests you do one chest every two weapons oh you actually still prioritize weapons nixie i i prioritize chest just because the amount of rng it takes for azimanic like unless you're chasing effectiveness or crit damage in the chest itself like this will you know it's easier also to complete the set so there's a lot of i think the a lot of more positive to get the chest than to get the sword because it only takes two pieces to complete the set. Um, but anyways, uh, I think I think you could build a really good spec tenny, like a really good one. Like where it's looking right now, the crit damage is slightly lacking, and that's it. Um, otherwise, otherwise it's solid. Otherwise it's solid. The, the health, like ten thousand, would be just perfect. But the defense, if you get ten thousand health, it's like it's bingo. It's good.
So I, I I'm almost I'm almost still like you know I kind of want to like force that T Surin chest on her, two seventy four crit damage with three thousand seven hundred sorry th yeah three thousand seven hundred attack very solid. Uh, you you do need an attack with crit damage immunity though to finish this. Mm, this one's not maxed. <sighs> no love for attack main rage necklace. True, true. I mean those necklaces are really good, especially if you want to roll high speed, right? Kappa. I'm just kidding. Uh, no, you should never do it. I know you're just kidding too. I know. Um, this sword. <sighs> nah, you can't. You can't roll it. You shouldn't roll it. Should you roll it? You rolled two. You, you rolled one into attack, so 6-6. Six, six. You rolled two into crit damage. So this is over... If you get one more attack, this would be a pretty decent one. Sir, that is a mace, not a sword. Wow. Wow. No, it's a sword. <laughs> you come to my stream? It's a freaking sword, man. Um, Rage says are so hard and you want to crit rage. Right True true no i wouldn't i wouldn't um anyways um do you mind you have 24 million gold i i think i'm gonna roll this weapon what do you say stream chat i'm gonna roll it i think i'm gonna pray for high like 20 attack so eight percent attack roll do it i'm gonna do i'm gonna do it because I, you're lacking immunity it will be it won't be useful in the long run but I think, I think, I think we can, oh wow, you didn't even get that, uh, that daily. <laughs> I'm asking a stream chat instead of the account owner. True. Well, the account owner, Med, knows that he lost all rights to his account once I'm taking control of it. So, all right, we'll use the fodders now. Cheap. Oops. Whoa, 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 whoa. You have a lot of fodder, man. Whoa. Hey, Professor Bloke, thank you for this. No! Dang it, Snitchu! Snitchu said effectiveness ink. Oh, crap. Sorry, I, I screwed up. I, okay, I'm not going to roll any more gear. I promise. <laughs> so, what did we get? Was that a five effectiveness? You said four effectiveness incoming. Let's go. Frick. I'm sorry. That sucks. That does suck. Although, although... Oh, okay. If you suck it up and you don't 90 this, your this spec 10 you're looking up on the screen right now is better than your previous. But you are taking away Kron's ring, which is a really good ring by the way. It's a really good ring. Um, and you're taking away ML Ken's helmet. So either either you want to do this yourself, because this is 450,000. I'm not gonna commit it for you. But honestly, this is de decent enough to 90. This one's decent enough to 90. This one's decent enough to 90. If it's not used on Spectenia in the future, it will be used on others in the future. DPS. <clears throat> Where's your streamer magic dragon? <laughs> Feels bad, man. K-Ron is your guild with defense. Okay, got it, got it. Okay, so we won't commit to it, but you know that you could do something like this. Um, it's pretty good. This this boot is a splash of everything, but it's actually usable. Um, Spectenia is kind of like that kind of hero. You need a splash of everything, but everything high. Oh man, that sucks, man. I'm sorry, man. That effect, that effect, man. It just didn't, didn't, didn't help. Okay, any, okay. I think that's pretty much it. So I think you got, uh, yeah. Mainly, I think your gear just needs to be rolled like 90, and you have a lot of decent stuff. Continue to do what you're doing on like the Discord, like showing us the screenshots of like what you think. Like I know you, you do the like the pep, pepe, hmm. Kind of thing like on what to roll or whatever that's good just keep it up i mean if you're still learning um but you got a couple pieces that i noted that are definitely priorities so i think that's all i can help you with man and then the, the mola still like you have so much mola find uh okay let me check, check your hero journal let's see what kind of heroes you have and i think this, this will be it let's check What the frick? Wait, wait, what? What was the percent? Ooh, big whale. Ninety-one percent, and I'm assuming you don't have. 
Uh, okay, Melanie, how about tomorrow then? Tomorrow? Uh, same time? Okay, let's do that. Okay, so you don't have some specialty change heroes. Okay, let's take a look at your... What are you missing here? What? You have all the four stars? Okay. Okay, so you... Okay, so the main ones you're lacking really is the ML5. Yeah, you don't have Shu. Every other RGB hero... Araminta you don't have. Oh, wow. Missing ML5 as free to play? Sure. Uh-huh. Sure. Free to play. Little Queen Charlotte. Actually, do we see that you built her? Oh, let's take a look. She's a pretty good one to build now. She's actually pretty good. Bruisers and self-sustainable and does high damage and very good like counter pick. Uh, very good hero to build. Let's take a look at your LQC. Not build. Oh, oh. Um, high priority. I would definitely do it. I kind of, I kind of half weighed her when I first pulled her. Like I didn't commit fully commit Mola, but with the new dev. Oh, I see you're still level fifty. With the new dev buffs, she's definitely worth. Um. Definitely worth. I mean, Guild War defense is highly dark as well. So if you want a Guild War defense DPS or offense DPS, she's definitely good. You think you have enough to promote? It's okay. It's okay. You don't. You might not necessarily have the gear. So just take your time. Actually, let's let's take a look. Uh, Luna is the same star sign, right? So we could use Luna as a base. Uh, there is a nine percent attack, so we'll just pretend that's not there. Uh, Luna, yeah, it's the same. Same star sign. Let's see if we could build a decent one, and then see if you want a ninety, I guess. Uh, so we want attack, attack ring, probably attack boots. Uh, okay, yeah, this is the same problem is that you need immunity and speed again. So we already know you're lacking on those, so I don't actually foresee this happening. Don't foresee it happening. Yeah, LQC is hard to gear, no, 100%. Um, she's hard, she's very hard to gear, actually. Okay, never mind, let's, let's not do it here. Let's not do it on this. Alright, dude, I think that's pretty much it. And, uh, hey, thank you so much, man. And even allowing me to roast you on stream. But I know you're, like, you're, like, really nice, so it's a fun. <laughs> Jagan takes advantage of the nice people. Alright, I'm gonna end here.